it's Ladies' Day at Aintree and we now have a winner of the Ladies' Day Style Award. Sue Moon drove away in a brand new 35,000 pound Range Rover Evoque after winning the top prize for her bold yellow frock. This year's judges were made up of ITV Racing stylist Sarah Kate Byrne, Jay Hind and a representative from the official Style Award partner, Kai Kai London. Thousands of glammed-up festival-goers flocked to the iconic Merseyside race course. Gates opened at 10.30 a.m. this morning. For day two of the three-day event. The last race is at 5. 15 p.m. We'll bring you all the action, some of the best looks from the day, and some fabulous photos. Do you have a ladies' day story? Email webnews at mirror.co.uk Key events results for the first RACE 1354 The fun has officially started 12-19 this year's style AWARD 1211 Statement hat steal the SHOW 1150 The gates are open 1032 1658 Grand National Ladies Day winner drives away in pounds 35k Range Rover A lucky race goer wowed in yellow to scoop the Best Dressed Award at Ladies' Day at Aintree. Sue Moon drove away in a brand new 35,000 pound Range Rover Evoque after winning the top prize. Judges identified five finalists in Ladies' Day's most anticipated event at the iconic Liverpool race course. Click here for the full story and all the pictures of her fab outfit. 1652 results at 16. 41st champ 94F second Emidem 5 1 third Lesnager Oscar 11 216th 51 fun photos from the day everyone appears to be having a fun time at the races today. Groups of friends cheered, posed and laughed as the day went on. Many were seen clinging onto their fabulous hats and fascinators to make sure they didn't fall off. 1630 results at 4.05 p.m. First Cadmium 8 1 Second Sub Lieutenant 25 1 Third Did Fourth Village 25 1 Fourth Janica 9 2 F 1554 Model Vogue Williams Strikes a Pose Model Vogue Williams has posed for the camera at the Aintree race course. She is looking classy in an all in one white suit, which ties in at the waist. Vogue has completed the look with a hat and a pair of dark shades. 1549 latest results results at 1525 1. Min 2. Politolog 3. Waiting P A T I D N T L Y 1535 Famous Faces at the Races Famous Faces who opted for a day at the races included Real Housewives of Cheshire star Tanya Bardsley and former Love Island contestants Chris Hughes and Olivia Buckland. Maiden in Chelsea star Spencer Matthews and wife Vogue Williams were also there, as well as Olympian Denise Lewis. More than 150,000 people are expected to attend the race course over the three-day festival, which culminates in the Randox Health Grand National Steeplechase on Saturday. 1520 men battle for style crown men give the ladies a run for their money in pattern suits and snazzy headgear. One wears trainers, while others opt for smarter footwear. 1501 results for the third race Here are the results for the two. 
50 p.m. Betway Mildmay Novices Chase, first, list in translation 3 1 second, top off the gum 10 11 F 14 52 F I V E race goers wear the same pretty little thing dress we've tracked down the dress that has taken entry by storm this year. Five ladies, and counting, turned up in the same number. Cream hued, it features a plunging neckline along with lots of frill and lace detail. The 70 pounds dress is definitely not for the faint hearted. Read the full story of the fashion clash here. 1446 still. To come 2.50 p.m. Betway milled May novices chase, G1, 3 meters 210 y 100,000 pound 3.25 p.m. JLT chase, G1, registered as the Melling chase, 2 meters 3 f 200 y 250,000 pound 4. 0.5 p.m. Randox Health Top Ham Handicap Chase, G3. GNC 2 meters 5 F 19 Y 140,000 pound 440 p.m. Doom Bar Sefton Novices Hurdle, G1, 3 meters 149 Y 100,000 pound 5. A 15 p.m. Weatherby's Racing Bank Standard Open NHF Race, G2, 2 meters 209 Y 45 pound 0001442 Pink and other fashion favorite lots of race goers have opted for pink for Ladies Day. Some have given a little nod to the color, while others have gone for head to toe bright pink. 1428 results for the second race here are the results for the 2.20 p.m. Betway top novices hurdle, first, first Felix does G7 have second, Araman 31 F 14 18 winner of the first RACE 1416 looking fruity as one race goer was spotted sporting a flamingo hat, this gentleman was pictured in a blue suit with pineapples all over it. Not afraid to stand out, he teams it with a pair of shades and white shoes. He could give some of the glam ladies a run for their money with this look. 1409 The party gets started between races as the races get underway, festival goers are embracing the party atmosphere. One enjoys the mechanical horse, while others head for the bar. 1401 TV stars pictured at Ladies Day Olivia Buckland, from Series 2 of Love Island, pictured with Corey star Helen Flanagan. Olivia looks elegant in pale blue, while Helen looks lovely in pink. 1354 KEY event results for the first race Here are the results for the one. 45 p.m. Mercy Rail Handicap Hurdle, first, three Musketeers 8 1 second, Point of Principle 25 1 third, Canardier 6 1 fourth, Stern Ribbon 16 1 hundred thirteenths, 39 race goers heel snaps as she poses for the cameras this lady proudly shows off her white, figure hugging dress as she poses for cameras. While she probably didn't expect the heel of her strappy cobalt sandals to snap, it hasn't dampened her spirit. 1324 Odds on a female jockey riding a winner Today the odds of a female jockey riding a winner on Ladies Day have never been lower according to Bookie Sport Nation. Bet. There have five chances for women to register victories today. Point one point four five Mohiyad, Bridget Andrews, eighteen twelfths. Fifty Chris's Dream, Rachel Blackmore, nine fourteenths point oh five Sub Lieutenant Rachel Blackmore, twenty eight fifteenths. Fifteen Ebony Jewel. Lucy Alexander 12 fifteenths point one five Black Hill Soft Dakota Rachel Blackmore 12 one thirteen twenty one Clerk of the Courses Low Down Clerk of the Course 
Andrew Tulledge gives the lowdown on day two of the Grand National Meeting. 1319 And it's not just the women battling for best dressed. Men have also been spotted making the effort. This man matches his pink tie to his fellow racegoers' dress. Whereas this man wears a tweed number, complete with a burgundy shirt and green trilby. 1312 Blue hues another popular choice as well as floral patterns, blue seems to be a popular choice at Ladies' Day. Racegoers have been seen looking glam in cobalt, navy and powder blue. One woman led a statement blue bag with a clock face, do the talking. 1237 Friends spent months planning their outfits Friends Charlotte Scotson, 22, Cara Cheston, 21, and Grace Myler, 21, from Wigan, said they had spent months planning their outfits Ms. Myler, who wore a dress which had a pastel pink skirt, said, It is a little bit stressful choosing an outfit, we always have fun here We've never had a bad day, even when it's rained. Jasmine Roby, 21, from Wigan, attended the event with her mother, Beverly Roby, 53, and friend, Emily Powers, 21, and said they were there to enjoy themselves. She said, sometimes there are bad pictures of women. But people are having fun and a lot of the time the pictures don't do them justice. Mrs. Roby said, We are just here to have a good time. 1236 Race Goer wears wedding shoes for Ladies Day. Jane Jones, 55, from Croston, Lancashire, wore a pink dress paired with cobalt blue accessories, including sparkly blue irregular choice shoes, which she had worn for her wedding. She said, I'm an Evertonian, so I got married in cream and blue and wanted to wear my shoes again. I've been coming to Ladies' Day since I was 18, and I think it's lovely. Everyone makes such an effort, and I always feel really comfortable, I've never had any problems or hassle. 1235 Who wore it best? These three ladies all look gorgeous in this cream knee length dress with statement shoulders. All three similarly pair it with a hat, killer heels, and a clutch. And if you fancy getting your hands on it, it's 70 pounds from Pretty Little Thing. 1228 Ladies' Day is about us all being great race-goers are wearing their finest for the famously glamorous event. Laura Barnett, 33, from Lytham, said, Ladies' Day is about us all being great. We're all amazing, and we are all here for a reason to celebrate ourselves. Her friend, Charlotte Partington, 34, said, It's all about having a laugh, dressing up, good fun and the atmosphere. Friends Sarah Brown and Nikki Shaw, both 36, both wore black and white for the occasion, with black fascinators. Ms. Shaw, from Bootle, Merseyside, said, I always have a great time here. Sometimes there are unflattering photographs of women here, but it doesn't put us off. 1219 KEY Event Fun has officially started The first racegoer has been spotted riding a mechanical horse. This means the fun has officially started. And the guys at Aintree Racecourse agree. 1216 athlete Denise Lewis arrives at Aintree. Denise Lewis has been spotted looking glam at Aintree for Ladies' Day. The track and field athlete keeps it simple with a navy shift dress with ruffled detailing. 
She pairs it with pointed quartz. 12-11 KY of Anita's year's style award racegoers are battling it out for this year's style award for their chance to win a brand new Range Rover Evoque, courtesy of Aintree Racecourse and a year's supply of dresses from style partner Kai Kai London. Entrants just need to be photographed in front of one of the four beautiful number fabulous free day flower walls, located in the Red Rum Garden, and at the main entrance, by the Jockey Club's official team, enter their details onto the competition form and that's it. They'll be on their way to being selected as a finalist for the Northwest's most fabulous competition, celebrating style and fashion.